We have the Biden administration's Secretary of Homeland Security, Alejandro Mayorkas, here on CNN, straight up lying to anyone who is willing to watch that fake media program and listen to the garbage that's being spewed out of his mouth. The clip is going to start here with Governor Greg Abbott from Texas giving his thoughts on the problem at the border first, and then Mayorkas is going to be allowed to chime in and share his lies. Check it out. The fact of the matter is there are laws on the books passed by Congress of the United States right now that authorize the executive branch to deny illegal entry. The president does not need new laws. The president needs a backbone to make sure that he he enforces the immigration laws that are already on the books. Couldn't be more wrong. Couldn't be more wrong. And as a matter of fact, uh, former President Trump uh, tried to close the border and it was enjoined uh, in the courts and never saw the light of day. This coming from an individual who is purposefully refusing to coordinate, communicate, collaborate with other officials and trying to wreak havoc in other cities and states across the country. Now, let me show you just how easy it is to rip this guy to shreds and reveal him for the disgusting, corrupt liar he is. In Biden's first 100 days by executive action, and this is what we're talking about, he repealed 94 of Trump's border policies within the first 100 days, which led to the disaster that we are facing right now. Put back the 94 executive actions he did by executive executive order repealed in the first 100 days. How about that? Did he need legislation? I just want you to know how much of liars these people are because he looked into that camera and he said, absolutely untrue, lying piece of garbage he is. Biden right now by executive action can reinstate any one of those 94 that he repealed. Does he need legislative action to do that? Did he need legislative action to repeal those 94 in his first 100 days? Of course he did it. When Biden did that, they bragged about it. They said, look how great we are. Look how civil we are. We're so wonderful. We took care of Trump's racist policies. And of course, under Trump, we didn't see any kind of numbers like we're seeing right now. And then we have the worst invasion into the United States that we've ever seen in our history. During Biden's administration alone, it's likely that 10 million and maybe even more, because these are only the encounters that we have on the books, even more than 10 million have crossed over into the United States of America. A disaster of administration. And look at this guy's face. All of you watching this right now know how much of scum this guy is and how much of a liar he is looking into the camera and trying to say that there's he can't do anything. He needs to That is a l absolute ridiculous false claim. And what they're trying to do is they're trying to blame. They're trying to project on others the failure that they caused. It's so easy to rip this apart. And I wish that that was the follow-up question, but it wasn't. I assure you, it wasn't. What do you think about this? Leave your comments below. I'll catch you on the next video.